Between the two people of Miguel and Gravity, I think Miguel is the level-headed one. But Gravity has a different level of pressure. Boy, Gravity! Gravity's the one that has to show out. Gravity feeds Miguel, and Gravity feeds Miguel's family. You take it too far. Yo, what's the deal, y'all? Uh, it's been a good time. It's been a good time on this journey, and I feel like I haven't had a chance to jump in and kind of catch up on content, which is something that I love to do, but uh, this is the first memos of memos based on the trips. My last trip was Santiago, Chile. And, 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 uh, it gets higher and higher. And I'm just, I don't have time to sit there and make really cool edits like on my vlogs. So I'm just gonna do it like this. Because this is easier. So let's get started. Oh, that was good, <laughs> there, man. Leave it there for a second, too, after. Once you quit, leave it there for a second. Okay, ready? Ready, Carol? Rolling and action. Just touched down in Santiago, Chile. The airport's like any other airport. <laughs> Team USA. I think it's insane that I represent Team USA. I think it's insane. So I'm back home in Phoenix, Arizona, and I have a three month hiatus of some sort. It's not really three months, but I wanted to take this time to kind of just catch up on uh, this Olympic journey and how insane it's been. I don't know what I'm doing right now. It's been a while since I've made a video. I guess it's more like, I guess it's more like, a, what do I say? A moment of self like reflection, I guess. Like it's been, an amazing time. It's been pretty cool. One, two, three. Oh, oh yeah! And uh, Gravity's interview seen 5,000. That's awesome. <laughs> learned a lot about myself. I learned a lot about, man, I learned a lot about myself, man. A lot, uh, and I'm still constantly learning about myself. But in these last, you know, five months, actually, these last two years, uh, has been insane. And so, I have three months to prepare for uh, Portugal World Finals, and then I have like five or six months to prepare for Pan Am Games, which is really just contingent on how Belgium World Finals goes. You know, there's a lot riding right now, and, and sometimes you have to make peace with the possibilities, you know? And at the same time, I'm like constantly grinding, no matter what the obstacle is. Uh, I'm just, I come in every day <clears throat> and, do what I, and do what I do, you know, which is prepare. <laughs> Trying to get on a whole other. Yo, we almost got on the wrong flight, and look who we running through. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's so sick. Who that there American dropping her stuff everywhere? Man, pick your stuff up. Why are you so messy? I don't understand. Oh, man, why you so messy? What's up, baby? How you doing? Look at that boy right there. Oh! We got one more for you. I don't even know how that happens. Come on, boys. Come on. Yeah. Are we in here with Japan right now? Yo! I like that. That's a vibe. Oh man, so next thing you know, Jeff, 
I'm Come here, here, Jeff. I'm not, I'm not going in there without you, bro. Come on, man. All right, What's so we got, we got to do this little transition right here. So right now, we, 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 we in Houston. We in Houston. All right, but now this is where we're going to be at. Yeah, in Brazil. Look at this place. It's beautiful. It's the Hilton. Looking mighty fine. Monster got it right. They did. Shout out to Monster. Holding it down. And we're walking over to the mall right now. Dang. Beautiful day. <sighs> that. Play, uh, Jeff won't eat no heart. There's some hearts here, but Jeff won't eat it. I won't eat it either. But the food looks bomb as hell. There's some rice, some chicken, some potatoes, some pasta, some fish. Damn. That's a giant ass pig. Hey, so we just finished practice. It was a good session. <laughs> Look at these two, they out of control. <laughs> yeah, but we had a responsible ones. I How do you say thank is. you in Portuguese? <laughs> Abi Abi, hold on, what's that? Yeah, real quick, Abi Obrigado. Obrigada. That's for, that's if I'm gonna say that to her. Yes. No, that's thank you. That's, yes, that's what we said. Mi scusi. That's not the whole other language. Now you're just being, that was, that was just out of control. I thought that was, that was just out of control. Was what like was the sex? I forget. It's gostosa. Oh, gostosa. I was close. Gostosa. The way gostosa. he was saying it I in the car to too, Marcus was like, gostosa. Yeah, <laughs> if you want to say like sexy, like yeah. I want to have sex, it's gostosa. And if you taste real good food, which is really, yeah. it gives good vibes to me. Yes, yes. It gives good vibes. I get it. All right, bro. So I'm trying to jump back on the vlog. Yeah. And I feel like I want to be able to provide some type of information for those people who aren't really in like, don't really know too much about breaking. You know, what is your favorite thing about being a breaker? And man, this is, wait, this is an actual good question because this is why I got into breaking. It's the, the freedom of movement breaking allows. When the freedom first, of movement that breaking allows, yes. When I first got into breaking, I didn't get into it because of the move. My brother, he was doing top rock. He was doing moves too, but every time he top rock, I was that was that's what captivated me. So every time before you get down to the ground, before you get down to the ground. So every time you know there's a party or something, somebody wants you to do a move. Yeah, I'm over here like, hey, hey, can you top rock? <laughs> hey, top rock. I just wanted to see him top rock, and I, that's what that was the first thing that got my attention to dancing. So uh, all right, so yeah, so that's your favorite thing about being a breaker is is the freedom of movement that breaking you're allowed. Yeah, that breaking allows. Exactly, I like that. Exactly. Mm. What's yours? What's yours? Uh, it's, it's crazy is that it's the same exact thing. It's like why I left gymnastics. There's no rules in what, how it's supposed to look. Yeah. You know, like for me, the best thing about being a breaker is that I can literally move however the fuck I want. And as long as it's to the music, it's cool. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Of course, there's a standard, right? We're not going to be off the wall doing some next level right? weird stuff. But like, even the weird shit is accepted if it works for you. So exactly. that's what's tight. Exactly. Remember, at some point, there's that circus stuff. Oh, which is people, fire, bro. People are doing random stuff. And not to be honest, I didn't see any foundation. Nah, but it was to them. That's what made them happy. Yeah. And they, and they you own that, and then, then you just gotta respect the fact that that's what makes them happy. Yeah. It doesn't need to be like. We can't. We don't need to judge it like, oh, it's whack or not, bro. If that's what makes them happy as breakers, then that's. That's true. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta acknowledge the fact that that's what that's what makes them happy. That's what keeps them alive. That's true. You know what I'm saying? So hell yeah. All right, good. That was a good one. Man. We're gonna ask Morris the same thing. Morris, what's your favorite thing about being a breaker? My favorite thing about being a breaker is that you get to do whatever you want out there. You get to express yourself. Like most people be stressing, and you, you get to see who you are when you're out there under stress. What type of person you are? What about you? I love practicing with breakers that like to elevate. What's your, okay, that's your favorite thing about breaking? Yeah, that's why I feel so good right now. Because yeah. we just did that. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. That was an ill session. Yeah. That was, okay. There it is. You were right. We were right on that. That's like the illest thing. It's like that freedom that breaking provides for your, your heart and your soul. It's, you know, it's something nobody... Although people judge you, nobody can truly judge you. Because at the end of the day, you're not going to change who you are for nobody.
I want to share this adventure to the best of my ability at its rawest form, open and honestly. But since I got back from Santiago, Chile, I have just been chilling. <laughs> Good one. Anyway, it's been good to be back with the family, and uh, I share this um, to just be transparent, you know, about the Olympic journey and how fucking cool it is and how cool it could be, and yeah. So let's see, let's see what I can scrounge together from all the shit. Let's start way back, like last year. Dang, two year journey. No, we don't got to go that far back. This year's enough. <laughs> I just fade away. I feel it. Fade away. I feel it. I fade away, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think too much. I feel it. Your love is fading. I feel it. Roll up, roll up. Hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. In order for you to actually truly understand this dance, you have to go through all the motions of each generation. How many of you guys have realized that what you saw in that video was what you looked like when you first started breaking? Really, really break it down like in order for you to run, you have to crawl. You know, and even before crawling, man, you gotta open your eyes and really pay attention to what you truly see. Look at these stairs! Hooray! Yes, 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 yes. It's better that way. Yeah. Okay, Set that's the He could. Actually, well, he, he could. Let's go. Yeah. Let's get it. Yeah. All right. Let's get it. Oh, you're built, so I'm good. Good. All right. Should the judges do it? Good. That's it, do it. All right, brother. So have a good day. Thank you. Uh, good luck with everything. Oh, I appreciate it, man. You too. Have a great one, man. I was a chauffeur. Legend. Yo. but when I was in Chile, I got like a, like a trinket of some sort, but it's a map of, don't judge me, but it's a map of the world, but like before Antarctica was all ice and on there it shows like you know, horses, rhinos, elephants, like all different, yeah. Yeah, look, look, there's a rhino right there. Is that a horse, is it an elephant? But it's super tight. Cause like what? Why is it all ice now? Back back to it. You know the coolest thing about Fies this year was that it was it was uh packed. 
He gonna be on that plane like. Mm. So, <laughs> so what's <laughs> better, a shot or a milkshake? Uh, milkshake. <laughs> Hey, at least I'm oh. cleaning you out. <laughs> I take a shot. To be honest, I take a shot over a milkshake. Uh, shot over a milkshake? Oh, you wildin'. Shot one. I think a lot of people would agree. Right before wild. battle, a shot or a milkshake? Oh, not before no battle. All right, but let's say if it was before a battle, shot or a milkshake? A milkshake. A milkshake? A milkshake. Uh-huh. You're crazy. Like massively packed fans from all over were there and it was thousands of people watching yo so today is the first official day of feast action sports and as you can see it's pretty fucking incredible got my my boy jeffro you rocking that dope catch red did it say something about an artist say something about an artist without without artists like a world without bees all, all those guys over there, all those people over there, breaking, breaking, breaking. Right, it was, it was a big deal. It was tight. Feast was like the illest um, of the events this week. Why? What's up, babe? I'm good. In our bathroom? Why? What happened? Why? You, it smells? Yeah. Excuse me. Probably, maybe, I don't know. But Feast was amazing. Feast was incredible. Uh, one of my favorite things was probably the weather out there this time. Because the first time we did it, it was intense, brutal. Like 100. Bro, we, we, we made it from. You had to start the tournament from top 130. We had two round robins. We had to narrow it all the way down. We just signed like 30 rounds uh, that, that day. And we came a long way to where we are now. Where, like, you, although they keep switching up systems and things like that, uh, you know, all in all, um, the competitions have been m more intense. The worst one was Brazil. The worst competition was Brazil. It was so massive and just so dead. Um, Chile was the best one for sure. All my ability and drive stems from doubt, but now my ambition is driven from the ability. The ability to succeed. Every time I accomplish something new, I set a different bar higher and higher every time. I know I can fly, but how can I fly? Where can I fly? How big can we go? At the end of the day, if I'm not a superhero to my family, then I'm not a superhero at all. Let's go. Thank you, Pebbles. You already know what it is. Your boy Jeffro, aka Mr. Ratty Daddy, aka Mr. Poppy on, aka Baby Ur, aka Mugler Burke. But you already know what it is. I'm over here with my boy Gravity. They can't hate Gravity Daddy. Every, every. <laughs> we go, we go. Yeah, Gravity Daddy. No, 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 yeah, 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 so, yeah, you know, we just came out of this competition and we're so excited. We're so hyped. We did this. We did this. We came this far. Where am I? Question. Turn it off. Turn it off. Oh. Y'all don't know that, but right no, no, before no, no, no. we came over here, we turned it we're on. We were in the elevator, we were like, hey, we need to turn it on. And we were like, this at the same time. <laughs> at the same time, it was random. Yeah, but anyways, that was looking at us like, she's lame. But anyways, yeah, so we're going to continue the story. I'm with Gravity. We're just now leaving the Pan American Championships. Grav, it's your first time getting moved. Oh, shit, yeah. How does that make you feel?